Hey guys, it's Nick from Retro Games HQ, and today I'm showing you the Steam page in the dev blog from yesterday of Into Drive, which is a monster taming RPG that just came out in early access. Now, four things: one, description is going to be in the, or the link's going to be in the description below. Two, it's only three bucks, so go ahead and get it because the price is going to be increasing as the updates come along. So if you think any point I like this, or it's a good proof of concept, or hey. Uh, I might like it in the future. I'd go ahead and get it while it's only three measly bucks. Uh, you know, you buy two soft drinks and you're probably passing up the three USD in price. Well, I know you are. So go ahead and if you want to get it, the other two things are like and subscribe. I would greatly appreciate both. Liking it will also get more people to see it, which will help this uh, indie dev because it's actually a solo dev uh, as well with Into Drive. Now, getting into it, you can kind of see. Uh, with these pictures, screenshots, what it looks like. Now we're going to go ahead and go down. There is a reason why they have early access, and it's this big, huge, long thing. I don't know if I'm going to cover that, but definitely we'll cover the update. But let's go into about this game. Again, if you think it's not fully fleshed out, don't, you know, won't play it now, go ahead and get it because I think there's a lot to come to this game. They've already added quite a bit. Uh, from content. I played an hour and it felt like there was more to do still. So, gameplay. Hack Into Drive into your crew, which the Into or Into Drive are the little viruses that you get to kind of hack and get, catch rather. Battle tool, Into Drive, and turn-based combat. Help the people of Cash Isle with Into Drive related incidents. Thwart the Forever Corporation's raid of the Isle and face your dev partner, Max Jai, I don't know, in battle. Because you are the Dev actually. So here's the plot. Plays one of the developers for Into Drive AR, an augmented reality game that was made to gamify an outbreak of computer viruses. Your partner in development, Max Jai, was the face of the business but never got his hands dirty to develop the game. He calls upon your help when realizing Into Drive aren't behaving how they were programmed. Into Drive began attacking and possessing objects in the real world. The Into Drive have become something more than you intended. It is up to you and Max Jai to go on a quest to rediscover what Into Drive means to peep the people of Cash Isle and save them from Into Drive related accidents or incidents. So, state of the early access build, it's actually at 0 .06 now. And there's a lot of things I'm going to go through, but I'm going to go down where you all can see if there's more stuff. Okay, well, we know what we're going to do right now. We are going to go to the sixth dev blog so they, uh, if you want to again go to the link in the description and you can find this where you can go to the early access trailer as well so here's what he's been working on preventing players from selecting monsters that are empty fixed missing monster connections python port filled with npcs python port has more interval buildings now i played for an hour and i've not gotten to python port yet python underground added as a new location battle cruise in python port uh, added audio sliders for music and SFX, so, uh, yeah. Added controller support for the sword system, fixed the bug, we're switching out. So you can see he's done a lot of stuff. So added more uh, battles to Java Pool, um, added new gradients to battle backgrounds, UI scaling, uh, added an intro screen before the main, so like adjusted catch rates for all monsters, adjusted experience year yield for all monsters, added and programmed in more, uh, in more monsters. There are now more than 100. It is early access. It is the point zero point, what I think it's like point zero six alpha build. It already has over a hundred monsters, as you can see. If you want to see some bigger stuff, then make sure, like I said, description. Um, check the description below for the link. So you know, it's just he's been struggling with some stuff, but here's what is important, which is about the dev. So, he's doing an introduction in this dev blog because it's going live before the early access alpha launch. His name's Noah Lewin Williams, and he thanks us for supporting. So, he's been making games since 2013. It's been a dream project to make a game like Into Drive. The last game was Apastron, a retro FPS set in the same sci-fi universe as Into Drive. Martha is actually a character in both games. 
So he's making the same commitment with InterDrive that he did on Apastrum. All future updates and add-on content is free for owners of the game. This is his first time that he's opened up the development process by taking part in early access. As a kid, following ROM hack creators on forums and waiting for the next patch, uh, it was a fun collab. Uh, there was a fun collaborative spirit that I that he hopes to recreate with the development of InterDrive. Now, if you like his work on, he's doing on InterDrive, the fastest way to get updates is to go to his Twitter, Instagram, and YouTube. So, yeah, that's about all for this video, I suppose. I mean, okay, so there are things like prices plan to increase after leaving early access, so go ahead and get it, like I said. Now, let me see if I can go to just... Let me go up. Yeah, right there, $2.99. It is three dollars if you have any interest in into drive whatsoever and have any money whatsoever i mean i'm like three bucks uh cups of coffee can cost more than that so i'd recommend getting it i've already got it i've already played it for like an hour i'm planning on doing more um yeah i recommend it to be quite honest even though it's in early access there's a lot of work to be done but there's already a lot of work that's been put into it. So that's all for this video.